What's up, fellas? Lady fellas. This is your boy Rowdy coming at you with a Fallout video. Now, today I'm going to be showing you guys another of my Any Weapon, Any Mod videos. Now, uh, a lot of these weapon mods are going to be coming to, uh, to us from our good friend Bugsy Trigger, who uh, showed off a lot of these weapons to me. Let's go ahead and jump right into it. First off, we're going to have the 762 Mega Pistol. And uh, this is essentially going to be a handmade rifle with a 10mm pistol barrel. And uh, yeah, let's go ahead and fire this bad boy. Pretty cool looking gun. I feel like it, uh, I don't know, it's like a little beastly pistol, honestly. Nice thing to work with. Um, this next one's going to be called Agony. And this is going to be my shish kebab with a shocking puncturing rocket attachment. So this is going to have a uh, huge damage increase from the normal shish kebab. And uh, yeah, let's go ahead and upgrade that. So now you're having two effects. And uh, it is definitely an awesome one. So for your melee users, this is going to be a really good one. Um, this next one is going to be the Bugsy Special. This is one of my favorites from uh, our good friend Bugsy, and um, yeah, I really like the one, the way this one looks, honestly. So uh, yeah, this one's going to be um, Silence, but uh, a really cool looking gun overall. Not uh, not too big in the damage department, but uh, definitely a good weapon to use if you, you know, want something different from the normal snipers that are in game. This next one's going to be the cold shoulder. This is going to have a hunting rifle with a lever action receiver and a long covered sniper barrel. This one also comes to us from Bugsy. Um, doesn't really use the lever action uh, rifle, but uh, I guess it does fill it in nicely. I feel like that little lever at the bottom kind of even if it doesn't actually use it to put the bullet in place I feel like it's a good guard I guess or some sort it looks really cool with the gun overall so uh... yeah this one's going to be old world tech this one's going to be one of mine um, essentially it's just um, a deliverer with a radium rifle receiver and a long um, 44 magnum barrel so uh... this one's pretty cool um, it's uh, still a one-handed weapon, so um, just give some new life to the uh, Deliverer. I feel like it's a little cool addition. Oh. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't know you were there. Anyways, this is another one of mine. This is going to be the Pulse Rifle. This is going to be a laser rifle with a plasma long barrel and a institute rifle receiver. And um, one thing I like about this one is that it shoots plasma bolts that explode with the laser effect. So uh, it's a kind of a unique weapon to have. I've actually been using this one for a little while now and uh, I really like it. Good amount of damage and, uh, you know, kind of gives some uh, new life because... The, uh, at least the ammo and bullet effects are different than pretty much any other weapon out there since it kind of has the, uh, the contrast between the green and the red. I feel like it does a lot for it. Um, yeah, this one is going to be another one that I really love that, uh, Bugsy kind of showed off for us. This is going to be the, uh, UAR 762, which is going to be the upgraded assault rifle 762. And, um... Yeah, essentially you just put a handmade rifle with a laser barrel and, uh, you know, put all the fixings on there that you would like. Pretty much the same still, but uh, I think that laser barrel honestly adds so much to the gun itself. So I'm uh, not going to do too much changes to the gun, but uh, definitely aesthetically pleasing and uh, something definitely you should add. Um... Last one that I'm going to be doing for you guys today is going to be the Zombie Killer. This is going to be one of the ones that I added. And um, it's going to be a combat shotgun with a plasma receiver and a automatic laser barrel with a short recon scope. This one is going to be a uh, 
uh, crazy. It's too big for the screen, so you kind of have to use a some kind of scope, like a short scope or maybe a recon scope. But um, if you ever want to get rid of something, this is the way to do it. Probably best to use it in third person, honestly. This also raises the ammo capacity to 32, which can literally devastate anything. Oh my god, Terrorbot, I am... I am sorry about that, man. So let's go ahead and test some of these out. Let's, um... Hotkey this fella right here. We'll hotkey the pulse rifle. We'll do the UAR. Let me see how many of these guys I can hotkey. There we go. Alright, let's go test this bad boy out. Alright, so this first one's going to be the 7.62 Mega Pistol, so... Let's see what we can do here. I'm going to just take over my uh, cozy little town of Sanctuary. I almost said Megaton. Really? That was it? Oh! Codsworth, I'm sorry! Yeah, Codsworth's a, Codsworth is a bit of a beast, honestly. Do this to take out this punk ass right here. Oh, Cogworth, no, don't do it. Oh, shit. Yeah, they don't, uh, they don't mess around. They definitely mean business. I guess killing somebody and possibly a friend or some family you know, found upon in this area. Yeah, so this shotgun is pretty much unusable, honestly. It's a little better than the one from my last video, but uh... Damn. A little more controllable. I want to find Marcy because she uh... She bugs. Come on, what happened, what happened, what happened? There we go. I don't know what happened there just now. I was just full walking without a leg. Yeah. Alright, let's get down to my... My personal baby right here. Who else is shooting? I'm gonna save you for last. Jeez, this agony is beast. Who's hiding in here? Oh yeah, it's Rhonda. Hi Rhonda. Oh, oh. Did 
Damn, I'm about to die. Let's see, which one else do we need to test? Uh, we could do this guy really quickly, but I'm honestly kind of getting ready to die here. Excuse me, excuse me, can you not do that? Thank, thank you. Anyways, that's going to be pretty much it for today, guys. Um, thanks for tuning in. If you liked the video, go ahead and uh, drop me a like or a comment. And uh, if this gave you any ideas of your own, go ahead and uh, let me know in the comments. If there's uh, any suggestions you have for me, I'd like to know that as well. So, uh, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. And uh, doses.